You can find him in the desert, you can find him by the sea. He'll climb a rocky mountain, he will nap under a tree. If you come along with pups, it's about discovery. So let's hit the trail to see what we will see. Well, hey, grandchildren, it's Pops, and we're here at America's Teaching Zoo with Hillary and... Jax, our Harris Hawk. So tell us about Harris Hawks. Where do they live? Harris Hawks um, live in the southwestern United States, mostly um, New Mexico, Arizona, and Texas. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. So uh, what does a Harris Hawk eat? So Harris Hawks, they're birds of prey, so they'll eat meat. They tend to catch um, smaller birds, rodents, or even reptiles. Oh, and so are you a student here at America's Teaching Zoo? Yes, I am. Okay, this is pretty cool. You get to work with with these creatures. That's fantastic. And I see you're wearing a glove. I assume that's for your protection? Yes, it is. Jax has these really sharp talons that she uses to catch her prey. So I'm using this glove to help protect myself from those sharp claws. So I couldn't put my hand out and, and put Jax on it right now. That wouldn't be a good idea. No, probably not. Uh, Although when when they lay eggs in a you said a pretty big nest mm -hmm. so who sits on the eggs and who goes and gets food so the mother will take care of the eggs while the dad goes out and hunts for food oh, okay and then how long does it take till the babies are born about um three to four weeks <laughs> oh, cool okay so why does Jax have a beak that's shaped like this so it's shaped like that so that she can um kind of tear into her food using her beak and rip it open so she can get all the yummy stuff from the inside. Okay, well, we've learned a lot about Jack, so how about if we see her fly? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, here we go. Where in the world are we today? Isn't it so nice? We can say a latitude and longitude for you and me is every single place we happen to be. Thanks.